The Ministry of Home Affairs is more than just the police department. From community policing to the LIU, cyber crime control, and the K-9 unit, the public may not be familiar with the services they provide in all six districts. And that's why, for the first time today in Belmapan, the ministry hosted an open day where students and the public learned about all the affairs under the Ministry of Home Affairs. And this open day is very vital for the ministry because it's significant and it impacts the different services that our ministry offers. As, as you know, we have a host of the different departments that falls under the Ministry of Home Affairs. And today we have the Belize Police Department. And under the Belize Police Department, there are several different units. So we have community policing, police out here. We have the tourism police. We have air tips and trafficking. We have the different K, um, operations unit like K-9 and so forth. And this is very important to us so that we can engage not only with students, but also with the educators and the wider, wider community so that they are aware of safety, security, and the different initiatives that our ministry has to offer. The minister also interacted with some of the students out of the dozen schools that were invited. I'm very excited to see uh, the elation uh, and excitement by the students that are here today and the general public, all of whom are invited to our ministry's uh, first open day, in which essentially we showcase all the units and departments of our ministry and remove the mystery because many times there's mystery, many times there's fear of police officers um, and to show students that police officers are here to help them, um, are here to support them. And so I think it's a very important uh, activity that allows officers, that allows different professionals in uh, the department to interact with students and to educate them on the various services that we have to offer. So what services does the ministry offer? We spoke with the representatives from some of the booths on display, and here's what we learned from the policing unit, the anti-trafficking in persons unit, and the leadership intervention unit. We have a total of nine different units out here today. Um, uh, we have the cybercrime, we have eight tips, that is anti-trafficking persons, domestic violence unit, community policing, canine unit, and the tourism policing unit, and several other units. The purpose of us being out here today is to tell people what we have to offer, how they can access what we have to offer. We oftentimes see people need to, to uh, access certain resources and certain services, but they don't know what to go, and this open day is all about today. Well, the scope of work that we do, um, we have a mandate to investigate all suspected trafficking persons cases in the country. We do have a a staff of eight full-time police officers attached to the unit to cover the entire country and that would include the Keys and the islands as well. So today we're teaching kids a bit about the work we do, trying to tell them to stay away from the life of gangs and gun violence. Of course, today is a very comprehensive look at what the ministry does. I think kids get a full rundown of from what the police does to what even our administrative um, executives do. So I think today is, is a bit of that comprehensive look that we have. These children are very lovely. They're super intelligent. They're, um, like I said, very aware of what is happening in the country. And we should never take children's ability to analyze what is happening around them lightly. Um, so that has been most exciting for me. My team of officers and my interns are here doing a great job. So I, I, that has been very fulfilling for me to watch children because quite often I don't get to interact with children. Jo Marie Lanza, 7 News.